Welcome to Luke's 12 Days of Christmas. We're going to talk about the open toe applique foot today. So I've got a little demonstration put together. Number one, we took our project or fabric and I stabilized it with some fusible interfacing. And I've got my applique piece fused down using a wonder under, heat and bond, any one of those would work. So we have our, our project ready to go and we're gonna do an applique stitch. I'm going to do just a traditional blanket stitch but the thing that I like about this is I am going to be able to see what's going on here because of that open toe. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna go slow, okay? So I can see very easily what's going on here and of course, with the Viking, you have lots of control over your stitches, but you can see that I'm doing a curved piece and I'm able to guide my project and see exactly where those stitches are landing. So let me get a few more here and then we'll let you take a look and see what we've done. Okay, I'm gonna hit my scissors. All right. So we've got the traditional blanket stitch going around here, but the idea of the open toe applique foot is that you can see right here exactly what's going on. Now I did just a traditional blanket stitch. Uh, of course, there are many, many applique stitches on the Viking machines. This is the open toe applique foot. We have it in stock. Come on in, pick one up. Uh, remember they are 40% off with our 12 days of Christmas promo. We do have a corresponding foot for the Genomi in stock. So hope to see you soon. Till next time, it's Brenda with Luke's.